kind of loosely based on your past, so it's a good good past to have had. Uh, <laughs> without making the movie, I'm not sure, but uh, but yes. Uh, no, at the time, I t asked my dad if it was a good past to have. Uh, <laughs> it might not be the same answer. Is he here tonight? <laughs> yes, he is. I think he's gonna he say. Was not, he was not gonna come, and then I was like, <laughs> I was like, look, you guys don't have to come. It's fine. And then they finally were like, fine, I'll come. Ten years ago, Channing's dad and all of us were introduced to Magic Mike. The shirtless scenes, sexy dance moves, and iconic crew, including Matt Bomer, Joe Manganiello, and Matthew McConaughey. He's kind of perfect. He knows how to talk, and he knows how to say things, and, and he could be talking about, you know, the weather, but somehow it seems more rich, just because it's coming out of McConaughey's mouth. You tease, you seduce. Behind the scenes, tell us a funny moment between all the guys, something that happened, because you cannot not have laughed this entire set. Well, we did laugh. <laughs> Six guys, we all knew what we had to end up doing. You didn't show up to this job and go, well, I don't think I want to wear a thong. You showed up to this job, and you were like, no, we're all wearing a thong now. Guess what? We've got to spend a week working out what thong we want to work on. And that's supposed to be really serious business. The hardest part about shooting this movie was not laughing hysterically in the middle of takes. So yeah, as soon as they yelled cut, we were just screaming, rolling on the floor. Three years later, Dallas's guys reunited for Magic Mike XXL, and ET was on set with them in Georgia. It's just a bunch of friends that got together and did some dumb stuff together. Like I mean, that's that's what it is, and and we have a lot of crazy times. The franchise continues with live shows in Vegas and London, which we visited with Channing back in 2018. Did you envision like this? Uh, no, it's a joke in the movie. That's how much we didn't <laughs> think that any of this was gonna happen. I mean, we gave, we gave it to Dallas to be like, waiting for our time to make our move, take our show global. And the third movie is going global too. Magic Mike's Last Dance just wrapped filming across the pond earlier this month. Well, you know we expect you to bring the heat. So, scale of one to ten, what are we getting? We're getting a hundred on this one. Like we're gonna hundred points on this one. But I know we're gonna throw everything in the kitchen sink at it. Selma Hayek joined the cast, replacing Tandy Wayne Newton, who stepped away for family matters. How much fun did you have with Selma? Selma came in and like just was a like a tour de force. Like uh, she made everyone work harder on set. There is not a question in my mind of why. She is who she is and she's done what she's done and she's gonna keep, like I think, just just blowing people's minds. I, I will do any movie with her forever. We all seem like you had so much fun. I, well, I don't know if I would say it was hard. It was hard, I'm gonna be honest. Like the movie, the, 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 movie, the, movie, the, movie, the movie was hard. <laughs>